is a registered firearm. I'm a police officer. Jeez, won't let me on his bus, won't let me meet his friends. said, laying low. Just keep laying low. I'll call when I've got Gouge out their eyes and slice off their ears. All right, I've got you on my GPS. Not far from one of their mobile command centers. You can shut that down. It'll limit their ability to track your movements. Mobile command center, got it. So what exactly does one of those look like? Well, it, it should be a large, heavily armored mobile unit with side ports and major communication gear on top. Woo -hoo! All right, I think I see it. A uh, badass RV with lights and metal crap on top. Okay, great. There should be vent panels along the sides. If you blow out enough of those, the core should overheat and be exposed. Okay, blow out the panels. Got it.
Remember, locate the mobile command center and destroy it. Should make things a little easier. Must be back up. I think I prefer the smaller guys. They are really stepping up their game. Definitely prefer the smaller guys. That's you, big fella. Ah, oh, crap. Well, did it work? Ah, uh, no time to check, man. I got dupes coming at me from every direction. Get the hell out of there. Yeah, great advice. I hate to ask, but any of your besties in blue know anything about these core relays? Yeah, well, apparently they've got them set up all over town. Seattle PD's been keeping an eye on them since the DUP won't tell them what they do. But you can find out where they all are. Sure. Like I said... Good. I need you to send the locations to my phone. What? So you can keep tapping them for more powers? No. Forget it. Wow. My own brother wants me to fight the ultra-mega bioterrorist of all time with less powers. Look, I didn't say that. Well, guess I shouldn't put it off then. Better go straight on to Augustine now and get it over with. Not sure what's gonna happen. All right, all right, I get it. Look, just stay away from Augustine and I'll send you the ones I know of. Thanks, Reg. You're the best brother ever. <laughs> no, the best brother ever would have locked you in a closet back in Salmon Bay for the rest of your life. Wow. Not sure a closet can hold a conduit for long, but I appreciate your wanting to lock me up. Reg, you should see this, man. The DUPs completely trashed this city. All the people are walking hunched over and nervous looking. Now, that's how martial law works. Control the city and the people by breaking them both down first. Yeah, well, occupying armies suck. You may want to keep that to yourself for now.
Reg, those uh, core relays we saw on the way here must have been cracked by all that destruction. This one's sealed up pretty tight. I doubt the DUP is going to let you borrow their keys. You're probably going to have to break them open. Oh, look, I just happen to have some mad new breaking skills. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Look out below! Not <laughs> bad, huh? Hey, you want to see it again? Man, how many DUP guys are in this city? Yeah, well, luckily you have the advantage in numbers, my man. Uh, how do you figure that? Well, because one person can move around faster, lighter, quieter. Plus, it'll make him underestimate you. Not gonna know what hit him. You wanna do me a favor and explain that to him? So maybe they'll just give up? Why? Spoil the surprise when it happened. <laughs> Good point. Reg, they got checkpoints and cameras on just about every corner. That's the benefit of having home field advantage. Except this isn't their home field. Try telling them that. Okay, so that way is not an option. It's better work. It freaking worked! 